All right, so guys, welcome to another video. We are here at Gonzaville. Here's the sea, and uh, over here, there's a road. This road leads to Grand Bassam. That's the road also that leads to Asini. We went to Asini, and here we are at uh, Gonzaville. Um, the airport is not too far from here, so sometimes you will see the plane coming from here. And here, this is a, um, this is a, um, a collaboration um, project between the Morocco government and then the Abidjan um, Potiphar government. And this place, oh, they are not done building this place. Like, this is amazing. <laughs> Also have, um, they also have they also have seats, uh, lovers bench or whatever you may call it, that you can sit with your friend and family and just chill. And I think it's also close to the port, right? It's close to the port, so you you are likely to see a lot of ships. You see a ship, you see ships around, and you see the planes of oh. So this is double double decker, double decker enjoyment. Once you're seeing the aeroplane, you're seeing them. I've seen the ships also sailing. My goodness, this is nice. Do you know how, how long the place is? How, how it stretches? Maybe about um, a kilometer or two kilometers. Position. To the starting of Bassam, it should be about eight kilometers. Eight kilometers. So this this whole uh, center is like about eight kilometers. There are some structures. There are, there are some structures here. Some are shops, right? Some are shops and some are rooms. So if if Côte d'Ivoire, they mean business. Oh. If you come here and you, you want to sleep, you want to sleep at this recreational center, there are rooms here that you can you can just uh, pay some money. We, well, we, we didn't get any um, official to, to talk to to give us all this information. But I think we've we found out from the security guys. He says he cannot pay the video because uh, we are, uh, his boss or probably they are going to talk and all that. So uh, we have the information and I believe we are giving it to you. We are, so they are, they are going to be put it here. There are uh, also um, uh, um, washrooms actually. There are washrooms and it's, 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 it's friendly to also. So if you are disabled, if you are disabled and you want to use the washroom, there's a place for you. There are men's and ladies' washroom as well. Wow. So um, do you know how long the project has started? The, actually, the project started in before COVID came. During the COVID time. During the COVID. So let's say 2019. So there about before COVID. Yeah. COVID came in 2020. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And the project started before a year before COVID. Have to pull down, take down a lot of coconut trees. Oh, so the they were coconut trees. Oh, all right. this place was coconut trees. They had to get rid of them. There were other kiosks, people in kiosks, and all kinds of. You know, they had to get rid of all of them. Uh, uh, these mini, mini drinking bars. Okay. They had to clear all of them to make way for the project to start. Wow. Yeah. So and since I'm, 2019, that is about four years yeah. it's been about four years yeah. and they're still they're still working on it yeah. wow so when everything is done you normally sundays here is packed here is jam packed i think the government just wants to take advantage of uh, the way people come here on saturday on the weekends to have fun to make to develop the place to maybe make some more money out of the place and beautify the place it's also. Been, yeah actually it's really beautiful it's, it's, it's really, really beautiful. It's, it's, it's very beautiful. And guys, if if you find yourself in Cote d'Ivoire, if you find yourself in Abidjan, um, um, 
guys of you, right? Exactly. Ones are there. Yeah, if you find yourself in the middle, I think you can see this. It's really beautiful.